first vlog i am taking you guys to the bengaluru's most popular food festival that is abare mela at basavankade it was held on national college grounds from 5th jan to 9th and i have a good news for the people who have missed the mela that is next avare mela event is happening at our rr nagar on jan 13 to 17th so so you guys can visit and try the authentic avare mela dishes and let us know how it was in the comment section below finally here we are heading towards the mela and it was a sunny day i must tell you and look at that guys look at the crowd there was almost more than 100 varieties of dishes and everything was made up of avre bele or at least the main ingredients was avre bele i have attached the menu here you guys can have a look for the couple of days they had the self vending machine to get the tickets but unfortunately the day we went it was not available so we stood in the queue to get the tickets and the queue was never ending and one important thing you guys should know is you should get the tickets first in the ticket counter and you can't get the tickets directly near the food counters Come let's explore the mela now. Apart from the food there was kids play area and massage centers and some stationery and clothing centers. The first food counter we came across was the dosa counter and look at the way they are preparing it was so satisfying yum is it the taste was pretty decent and they served the avre bele dosa with the hitgin bele saro chutney was the missing factor for all the main course which they served there in the mela Who all missed the chutney in the mela like I did? Let me know in the comment section below. Next to the dosa stall, we came across vadas and bundas counter, and vada was hot and spicy. And remember, guys, if you are planning to visit mela, get prepared for the crowd. because for every counter you have to wait minimum half an hour here you can see varieties of sweets which all of them made up of avare bele and there's buffy lado chickies and many more and here you can see a bricalo mixture this is one of my favorites and must try and i must say jalebi was the show stopper and it was also made up of avre bele here is a quick tip please have the jalebis when it is served hot and avoid getting it parceled next we came across the holy cake counter but the queue was very long 
but anyways i managed to capture a video for you guys so watch and enjoy The next thing we tried is this Masuru coat balayage and it was not up to the mark at least for me and again the chutney was the missing factor. There was ragi balls, avre bele pulao bhats and upama and they all are served with hitkin bele sambar. And at last we tasted this Avre Bele ice cream and we came out of the Mela. Finally, my experience of the Mela was not that great because of the crowd and the crowd management there was very bad. And the food was also pretty okay. So yeah, here's my review. If you are also planning to visit Mela, please don't go with the high expectations. And by the time we left the Mela, we were so thirsty. So we had some cold drinks in nearby bakery. And now we are moving ahead to the Big Bull Temple. How can we miss the Big Bull Temple when we are in Baswangudi? Right? So the next stop was Baswangudi Temple, the Big Bull Temple. Because of the trees all around, the weather was soothing and very calm. Near the temple, they made these beautiful statues. For one sec, it felt so real. They made the statues with the theme of Kadle Bele Parse. And this is also famous in Baswan Gudi. It all looks so real and beautiful. Let's go into the temple and get some blessings. say that this Nandi Murti is situated 500 to 600 years ago and this is the second biggest Nandi statue in South India. This Nandi Murti is made up of single stone. Its approximate height is 12 feet and 20 feet long. There is a history behind this temple about how the Nandi Murti got situated here. You can have a look here. And here is the quick tip for the new bloggers like me. Please keep a check on all the things you carry because I lost my favorite umbrella. So. It might happen to you as well, so be beware of it. 
Outside the temple you can find people selling this beautiful showpiece. While I was coming out of the temple I found this cute little puppy so thought to capture it. So cute. Isn't it? you guys in my next vlog till then take care and bye bye